Hey guys, today we're going to talk about uh, an update to my dick pics video. If you guys haven't seen it, just search on YouTube, I like dick pics, Tara Babcock or something, it'll be there. It's one of my more popular videos uh, and I wanted to kind of update you on what's happened since because a lot of people are saying, oh my god, she probably got like a fuck ton of dick pics or something. But first I want to talk about uh, something that was said in the comments. Um, I really like to respond to you guys, and uh, some people do see a problem with that or something. Uh, another girl gamer, or whatever you want to call it, uh, said that I shouldn't respond to people because that just means it bothers me, and I wholeheartedly disagree with that. And then some other people are having a problem with me uh, sticking up for myself, saying that that's all I do, which kind of definitely isn't true. <laughs> um, but the reason that I do respond to the haters is because I believe, deep down, every single hater, unless they're just like, blatantly like the ridiculous haters that are like 14 years old that come in and say slut, slut, whore, slut, slut, and bad grammar and don't even know what the fuck they're talking about, or like some jealous girl that comes in and, you know, is, has self-esteem issues and she doesn't have the intelligence to overcome it, uh, and she just wants to sit there and talk a bunch of shit on every single other girl's profile. Like, those people, okay, they're irredeemable maybe, but I feel like most haters deep down are just people who are ignorant of certain facts because they don't have the same type of life that I have, and that my perspective on things will kind of help clear things up as a whole for, you know, the small part of society that does watch my YouTube videos. And that's one of my missions, I've told you guys before, uh, in having the, this vlog channel is teaching people that sexuality is not only just something that you can use to gain viewers or to gain money But it's something that everyone has inside of them and everyone should kind of Understand and see that it's healthy see that it's natural see that it's you know an amazing part of you that you shouldn't just ignore because you're you know, insecure about it or because society says that sexuality can only be used to gain views. Like, that's fucking stupid. It's completely healthy to love your body. It's completely healthy to improve your body as long as you have, you know, realistic goals and you are confident in yourself and confident in your choices. All of these things are perfectly normal and that's one of the things I want to do is I want to clear up those little areas of society where people think that sex is bad or girls can't be hot and game like all of these things I want to prove that everyone is not a stereotype that I'm not a stereotype that a lot of the girls that they prejudge are not stereotypes um so that's why I respond to people because I think you guys are intelligent enough to hear and debate with me certain things and like somebody said uh, other youtubers don't do this shit and it's like I don't know why they don't do this shit but I would surmise that they either don't have the intelligence to debate it they ignore it because they were told that's what they're supposed to do if they don't care about it. You know, if it doesn't bother them, they should ignore it, right? Well, in in essence, that's correct. Like, if you're in high school and someone's picking on you, yeah, just fucking ignore that shit and be confident in yourself. That's a good message. But as someone who has a limelight and as someone who others might look up to, I feel like it is their... It's good for them to address certain issues so that people don't just see preconceived notions and just keep thinking it. You know, they get enlightened by different perspectives and different walks of life. Because most of my viewers are not hot chicks who play video games. They don't really understand the life of a hot chick who plays video games. They don't understand the workings, the inner workings of me or the inner workings of people like me. And it's very important to me to put that out into the world. So hopefully that makes sense. Um, I don't like try to defend myself. I don't feel the need to defend myself at all. I'm 100% happy and secure with the choices that I make in my life and they're, I've never done anything that I like really regret. I mean there's things that like, oh I wish I had gone and done this today, but never anything that's like a huge regret because I make sure that I'm like secure with all of my choices and life choices especially. So yeah, but um, let's talk about dick pics. Oh, let's see if I can lay down. Woo! Lazy as fuck. All right. Um, so a lot of people are saying that I'm probably going to get a fuck ton of dick pics after I post the I like dick pics video and I haven't gotten a huge increase. Like I got one from a guy who's also a YouTuber who I talk to, um, he's not a famous YouTuber or anything, uh, just he makes YouTube videos and we talk because he's cool. Um, well I guess he has, su he's not like anyone you know probably is what I'm saying. So uh, he gave me one and uh, a couple other fans gave me one but there hasn't been an increase. It's just like the same amount of dick pics as usual, plus a couple that say, oh, I hear you like dick pics, girl, here you go. But something that I found interesting is that every single dick pic I've gotten hasn't been bad. Like, there's never been one that I open where I'm like, oh, it's atrocious, what is this monstrosity? Oh, what is that? You know, it's like never like that. It's like minimum six and a half inches, nice shape. And if they, if they take a picture of their body at all, it's like an in-shape body. And I found that to be interesting. It's obvious that people 
are not just sending girls these atrociously disfigured dicks on a hairy, flabby body in the worst angle possible and being like, hey baby, check out my dick. Like, that is not something that's happening, right? So I don't really f understand why so many women have made videos saying, we don't fucking like dick pics, no women like dick pics. That to me says that no women like sex or they don't ever like sex for any physical reasons. Like what? You just like don't want to get anywhere near the dick. So like blowjobs are off the table. You can't enjoy blowjobs. You can't enjoy facials. You can't enjoy pretty much most of the things about sex. You just want to like get that dick inside of you and hide it so that you don't have to look at it. That's like so sad to me. Like what? And people who say that they like don't like balls, like balls are gross. I love balls, they're so cute. I like playing with them and, you know, licking them and suck on them. Why not, right? It's like, why would you, like, enjoy sex if you don't enjoy the sexual organs? And, like, I know a lot of guys also don't like, uh, pussies. Like, they don't like the look of pussies. So that's really weird to me, too, because I think that pussies are pretty. They're like a flower, and as long as they're you know, shaven and well kept, which obviously they should be if you're going to be dating this person, uh, they should be to your liking, then they should be attractive and I don't see why they wouldn't be, so it's very weird to me that people are saying that they're not attracted to the actual sexual organ. I think it's very sexy. It's, you know, it's part of your sexual organs. Why would it not be sexy, right? Um, and then a lot of girls say, like, okay, so the way I see getting a dick pic is like, imagine you're a super famous guy, like Brad Pitt, or someone else, and you happen to actually look through your DMs. I'm sure there are a bunch of, like, rock stars and actors and professional football players or whatever who get, like, a ton of girls just, like, showing their tits or their naked bodies or ass pics or whatever and sending that to them in a DM somewhere. I'm sure that happens. Now, if they actually look at their own stuff and they notice these things, I'm sure they'll be like, yeah, nice tits. They probably won't reply because, you know, they that would be unprofessional or something of them, but they look at it, they enjoy it, and then they move on. That's how I feel about dick pics, and I don't see why I wouldn't. Nice dick, bro. Cool. Close the email. Next email, right? It's like, why would you not enjoy that? It's like someone getting hard for you or thinking sexually about you and then sending you an homage to that, and that's all I see it as. I don't see it as anything disrespectful. I don't see it as creepy. I don't understand why you would. I guess because of this, like, rape culture fad that people have going on where they think that any guy who looks at any girl in a sexual way must be a rapist or blah, 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 whatever feminist fucking bullshit that's going on today. But it's not like that. Like, men admiring a woman's body does not mean that he wants to rape her or, you know, disrespect her in any way. It means that he admires her looks and would probably like to get to know her as a person as well because of those looks, which is what everyone sees first in the first place because everyone has eyes and that's just how it is. And it's just so stupid to expect anything else. You don't walk by on the street and you're like, Damn, that girl has such a good personality. I can tell by the way she moves her hips. Mm. Like, that's just not a fucking thing, right? So yeah, that's my update on dick pics. I haven't gotten a lot more dick pics. I feel like it's just because, you know, people aren't going to show off a dick that they don't find attractive. They're not going to be like, oh, I don't really like my dick, but let me show it to this bitch. You know, it's not like something that happens much. Um, and people are probably afraid that I'm not being honest when I say that I do like dick pics and that I'm not disgusted by them because I saw that a lot in the comments. People were like, she doesn't really like dick pics, she's just trying to get views. That It's like anything I do that's opposite of what the standard woman will do, which is basically me, just opposite of a standard woman. Anything like, oh, doesn't really like sex, loves sex, oh, thinks porn is evil, thinks porn is great. You know, like all this stuff is just like, not me. Hates video games, only likes shoes and purses. Hates shoes and purses, loves video games. <laughs> it's just like who I am, and I never lie about that for views. I mean, I do a lot of videos that don't get that many views because I feel like it's something that's important to talk about, or I'm just talking about my day and stuff. So, uh, let's conclude that with some updates. I will be doing a new Tara Reads comments. People were asking where the fuck that shit is. I'm shaking a lot because I took a caffeine pill trying to stay awake because I have a fuck ton of videos to do and then I have to stream. Uh, what else is there? I started playing Final Fantasy Type O and I started playing uh, Final Fantasy XV demo, which has been great. I actually finished it. It's not very long. Uh, and I'm gonna post some videos of that too. I'm gonna do like a losing my virginity from my PS4, so the commentary isn't gonna be live, but it's gonna be really cool. Um, I'm gonna do a video of chocobos from that. I got a video in a cave fighting goblins or something. Uh, and one from that Cindy bitch. Cindy is like the hot bitch in, uh, Final Fantasy XV that everyone fucking hates because she's hot and they're like, oh, sexuality in games, <laughs> Fucking retarded. But, uh, she's hot, she's cool, she's like a rednecky 
sounding chick, but that's cool. Makes sense from where she lives. She's in like the boondocks fixing cars. Uh, what else is there to talk about? I'm losing so much weight. It's amazing. Ah, it's been great going to the gym. I It's gotten to the point where I can just do like 40 minutes of cardio and I'm like, fuck, I should probably stop. It's been a long time doing cardio. Cool. And then I just leave and I get on the scale and I'm like, oh, I lost two more pounds. That's sick. Um, still got a long ways to go though. I want to be like super skinny. Super skinny and fit. Like not like skinny fat or like so skinny that I look gross. Just like my vision of perfection that I've like been before, but I didn't like my face as much back then and my makeup style was lacking because I didn't have the skills that I have now and like my hair is finally growing out from when I stopped using conditioner and like it got kind of unhealthy and now it's like super healthy again. I'm like, yeah, but I should go because it's been 10 minutes. I'm probably going to do another vlog after this because I feel super vloggy today and I've had caffeine. So I'm like, bah! so yeah, uh, picture. Bye guys. Ah!